Drawing Bronco fans to this Denver neighborhood. It seems like the orange and blue is all over town. Well, it's actually bigger than I thought. Uh, it takes up like the whole building, which is pretty impressive. It's a two-story mural of quarterback Peyton Manning, done entirely with spray paint by street artist Gamma Acosta. It's not the same as uh, doing canvas or having art in a gallery like this. Anybody and everybody can see it. Media company Clarkson Creative is across the street and captured the creation in a time-lapse video. It took about 25 hours to cross three days, using about 50 cans of spray paint. It's a free hand, so there's no stencil or grid or projector or anything like that. Gamma's relative owns the building, and he's been looking to paint a Bronco mural for a while. There's another one in Longmont. So this is a t-shirt made of the mural I did in Longmont. He also included a GoFundMe address for his cousin Leo, a Bronco fan who's currently fighting stage 4 cancer. Oh, he just kept popping up on my Twitter feed. And while the mural's popularity grows... It's awesome, it's huge, it's cool, it only took him three days. The artist hopes to shine a light on the street art scene and celebrate a city united in orange. You probably won't see Colorado as united as you will when the Broncos are in the Super Bowl. Well, win or lose, the mural will be here for some time, although the artist says that he plans to add it, add to it, if slash when the Broncos win the Super Bowl. Reporting live in Denver, Mark Taylor, CBS 4 News. Good stuff, Mark. Thank you very much. You got to check out my Twitter feed, at Vic Lombardi. I've got artists renderings from all over the state. Still ahead of Broncos.